I'm concerned with satisfying ball flow, kinetics. I, I, I will not sacrifice, I will not sacrifice a great shot on the play field. As in Steve Ritchie has designed some of the best-selling games that Williams has ever built. From Flash, Firepower, and High Speed, to Black Knight, F-14, and most recently, Terminator 2. My games are never subdued. They're always intense, as intense as we can make them. Um, I'm not sure why that is, but I don't do cute. Steve's newest game is called The Getaway. It's based on the same theme as High Speed, arguably the most profitable pinball machine of all time. I would say I'm a speed freak. It produces an adrenaline you can't get any other way. That's what we've tried to embody in The Getaway, is that adrenaline. Although it's based on high speed, the getaway is much more advanced than its predecessor. Brand new features include the supercharger. It actually has enough force to move the entire game. The ball spinning around, it moves the game slightly from left to right. On the front of the cabinet, a gear shift replaces the standard shooter. While you're playing the ball, hitting the flippers, you reach down and shift, and, uh, and, and you've got to coordinate that with not losing the ball, and it's fun. The getaway also features a fully functional tachometer, electronic flippers, and a sound package that includes a classic license from ZZ Top. Begin the getaway with a gear shift that fires the ball onto the play field and around the back to the upper right flipper. Speed millions are then achieved by successive shots around the small loop. The central feature, the supercharger, starts lit to give players a hint of the game's velocity. The tachometer is advanced by completing these RPM loops. Players need one loop to redline in first gear, two to redline in second, and so on. After each redline, the gears are advanced with the shifter on the front of the cabinet. Each gear holds a different award. Redlining in first brings the player three million points. Doing the same in second gear will hold over the bonus and bonus multiplier. Video mode is achieved by a redline in third gear. During video mode, players use the left and right flipper buttons, along with the shifter, to negotiate a congested highway. Four RPM loops in fourth gear will begin supercharger mode, when all major shots are worth millions. Finally, if a player can push the game into a fifth gear red line, he can enter red line mania with one more shot to the supercharger. Multiball will begin, and every major feature will be lit. The scoring possibilities are endless. The road to multi-ball begins with these traffic lights. Lock balls by contacting all three stand-up targets of a particular color. Once a bank of lights is complete, the ramp at the back of the playfield will lower, clearing the way for a shot to the lock mechanism. After two balls are locked, run the red light by locking the third. Then, after a quick show, multi-ball. Dispatch, this is 504. Suspect winning a red light. Over. Roger, 504. Apprehend him. A jackpot can only be achieved during multi-ball. But first, the ramp must be lowered with a shot into the supercharger. Then, either right flipper can be used to collect the jackpot with a shot up the ramp. If a player can then send two more balls into the supercharger, he'll have a chance to score a super jackpot with the same shot. In order to cultivate a dedicated following, two ball savers have been designed into the getaway. The kickback feature in the left drain lane will propel a doom ball back onto the play field. Kickback is relit when one of the two target banks is complete. Another feature called free ride returns a ball to the play field should it drain too quickly. Move. Near the bottom of the playfield are the freeway lights. They are advanced like this. After a ball comes down one of the return lanes, the player must then send it around the freeway loop. This will advance freeway values toward light extra ball, 
which can be collected with a shot to the eject hole. Also collected at the eject hole is the burn rubber random feature. Burn rubber is lit with a gear shift and awards one of 15 items such as video mode, extra ball, instant multi-ball, and big points. The supercharger was designed with an eye toward both minimum maintenance and maximum earnings. It circulates balls optomagnetically, like an atomic particle accelerator. Most importantly, it uses no moving parts. The result is one of the most exciting and trouble-free features ever designed. Another first is this new pivoting playfield mount, which permits effortless service to both sides of the playfield. In the first position, the playfield is moved up and out to expose the back portion in a way never before possible. Now, when opened, the playfield will stand over a foot higher in the cabinet, providing easy access to every component. For the first time on a Williams game, you'll find this true pitch level. This speeds game setup as playfields can be leveled without removing the glass. Other getaway features include all stainless steel ramps and an uncomplicated single level play field. The Getaway is a physical game that offers players and operators a brand new experience. In the Getaway, players will find the kinetic embodiment of the driving experience. Inside the coin door, operators will discover early profits and the kind of massive stable collections that can only be earned by such a truly addictive game. The Getaway from Williams, carrying on a tradition of games built to be intense, as intense as we can make them.